Hey, so here's Mari. Um, in this little tutorial, I'm gonna be showing how to extract or how to convert an ISO file to um to an exe file so that the installation of a, a file could be like easier. For example, you might use a dream dream spark and try to for example download a program Microsoft program. For example I've downloaded um Visio 2010 and in the file is an ISO file so that if you want to install it you click there then you have this um a window. You don't want to have it, you want to install the the, the document uh, the you want to install the program like directly. So there are so many options to um, install to convert it to an XFI. There are um, plenty of options. I kind of think you have a demo tool, demo tool. I think I have it also here, demo tool leader. You do. You have. Uh, you also have. Um, Magic, magic ISO, magic ISO also. You have it here. Might help you. Um, I think um, you have plenty of options. But um, I've been using so many options. But the easiest one, which is why I wanted to make this tutorial. It doesn't last that long, but um, it shows a very efficient way to um to extract the files from the while converting it to an X file. So what we're gonna do is what we are going to use WinRAR. It's usually already installed it, uh, installed in on your computer. Well I've got it installed. I didn't install it, it was installed when I bought my computer. But if you don't have it you might just want to go or uh, to enter the, the, the word like um WinRAR download on in Facebook uh, browser and you probably get it installed. It doesn't last that long, it just um it might just work like uh, depending on what is the speed of your internet connection. So basically what we're going to do is what we're going to create a file of a new folder named uh let's say um easier 2010, which is uh we're going to we're going to what the file we extract from here we extract from here we're going to install uh, to send them here. So basically, what we're going to do is we're uh, we're going to right click on the the file and then we're going to extract. Uh, this is French. Extract here. Which means that if I click here, it's gonna inst it's gonna extract it on on my desktop. But here, extract file. I'm gonna click here to um choose what uh, which direction it, it should take. Uh, it should take or where uh, I want it to to be saved. So I'm gonna click here, extract file. Becoming, it's a little bit frozen. It's a bit frozen. So here we go. So extract file. Here you want to make sure that it goes to the folder the folder we we just created, which is um on my desktop. It, it might be uh say a. Uh, the file might be created somewhere else, then you might want to ch ch search from here. From this, or, you, know, you might want to, show, to search from there to find something <coughs> where it is to install. So basically, I'm gonna look for my folder here. So I have it here. So I'm gonna click um, OK. Well, basically, I've done it before, so um, which is why it's uh, it's saying that. So basically, I um here it is. 
So I'm gonna I'm gonna delete it. I'm gonna delete it so that I don't have the same problem. So here we go. So we're going to click here. So extract uh, files. Here we go. We have we have it now. So now we are going to look for the video folder. Here we go, and we're going to install it there. So here we go. The extraction has started already. Uh, you can see uh, here's the top bottom. At the top bottom, you can see you can, you can see that you can pause it. Uh, let it go again. Um, you can see the um, the the time left. You can see the time already uh, gone. So basically, it's gonna last uh, less than a minute. It doesn't last that long, and really, it's the most efficient way to um, extract files from there, which is um, because some some people might have the same problem. The the usual because when you go to internet and for a, for somebody that has never used the internet, you can go to internet and want to you, you might want to uh, install a program you are basically used to um, these exit files so that when you download it you can just click on it and it installs the the <coughs> the programs but uh, for the for those one for this one you might have a problem because uh, you might be afraid because you see like you see the uh, an ISO file you you don't you don't have to uh, you can see that the the extraction has finished already so we are going to go to uh, the physio file and open it to see what has happened so here we go the file is all uh, extract, extracted and uh, here is the setup file so it's, it doesn't last that long it's just like two or three minutes to extract the file and it works perfectly so thanks for watching and it was